Hello folks, well, welcome back for I'm the one, the only Hobo Tom. Cheese Pop, it's Easter. Don't give my audience the middle claw, what's wrong with you? And this is the Easter Kitty, Cheese Pop. My kitty, also known as a Hobo Cat. You can't keep on giving people, my audience, the middle claw. I mean, today is the day that our Lord is risen. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, go back here now. Ah, oh. never wake a sleeping kitty cat, I guess. Again, happy Easter, everyone. As you can tell, I'm not wearing a wrestling shirt. I'm wearing a nice little happy, bright paisley color shirt. Most importantly, oh yes, my Lenten promise is over. Oh, so good. We had a happy Easter, everyone. Enjoy this special presentation here from the Daytona Beach Bum Fight League. Stay tuned for some fireworks at the end. It is a joyous day. I'd like to wish everyone, all my subscribers, my loyal viewers, even just regular viewers. Yes, I don't discriminate between loyal viewers and regular viewers. Not on Easter of all days. So I'd like to thank everyone for watching. Thank you all for your support. Again. Check me out. I'm going to be doing some more movie reviews this week or yeah, sometime this week. It's going to be WrestleMania predictions and also in the month of April, Triple Mania starts. Ooh. Again, enjoy this special presentation of Easter Mania from the Daytona Beach Bombay League. Stay tuned afterwards for some firework displays. So thank everyone for watching. Thank you for your support. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. And happy Easter, everyone. Also, let me know in the comments what part of the chocolate bunny is your favorite. The ears, the nose. My favorite part is the chocolate-covered bunny butt. Yes. Thank you for watching. Enjoy the wrestling, folks. And stay tuned for some fireworks. Hello, folks. Welcome back to the Daytona Beach Bump Fight League. For I am the one, I am the only, well that is the Easter, the Easter Bunny? That looks like John Cena, or Rob Beers. Nevertheless, I am the one, the only, I am a Hobo Tom. And I'd like to thank everyone for watching this special presentation of the Daytona Beach Bum Fight League Wrestling. It's Easter Mania, it's that magical time of the year where I get to go back to the bar where you eat meat, gamble, do all the other fun things I like. And also we get to see, watch the heat. Quote, unquote, Easter Bunny Russell. Yes. Again, we take a nice little break there, nice little stretch between Valentine's Day and today, or actually Mardi Gras. Or sometime like that, I forget. Mardi Gras, Valentine's Day. This year was all together. Yeah, but it's Easter though. Again, I can wish everyone a happy Easter. And do not forget the best part of the Easter bunny, in my opinion, are chocolate covered bunny butts. Some like the ears, some like the nose. I like the chocolatey ass of it, of the Easter bunny. And that sounds, by the way, fairly disgusting. Yep. It's that time, so let's see who the Easter Bunny gets to face. I am the home. You will need to get back to work. I am the American. And you still have stuff to sell. It's our tour. No, it's Sunday. You have to work on Sunday. I'm not working on Sunday. Just the way I like it. Not because it's past midnight, technically it's Easter Sunday. I've already returned to the bottle. Yep. Yeah. That's the way it goes, folks. Let's 
hustles. And this is going to be a special Easter show. We'll see, there's some special guests. Oh, one main special guest. Featured. And we'll get into this a little bit later. Easter probably comes right out. When he knows there's a strong point. And there's the reversal. Wow, that was a quick reverse. What the heck did I do? This is exactly how he drew this one up. He's starting to stumble here. He's still got plenty of gas left in his tank, though. Regard, he, he, I guess he, uh, that can't be enough, can it? I don't think so. Oh. He's looking a little off balance. I'm not sure how much more he has to give. It's just too early to make a call at this point, Cole. Yeah, I agree. This match can still go either way. And you know, it's just amazing to me that this is just another night in the WWE. Always memorable. It's starting to look bleak for him now. Oh, that's it. This one's got to be over after that. But you know what? Guys, no matter the format or competitors involved, oh, you can just know. Thanks for coming. And escaping to the outside, a veteran move to avoid the pinfall. I don't know if that's a veteran move or cowardice. That's it. He's out. Wow. He's still down after that. He's in full-on attack mode now. Oh no, couldn't we see the death of the He's Easter Bowl? Ooh, right into the road. He's not careful. This can snowball out of control oh. for him in a hurry. Oh. Sometimes I wonder if we're watching the same match. I mean, this one's still far from over, Cole. Oh my gosh! Because 
the Easter Bunny defeated the Undertaker. It's on our second match for this Eastern Mania classic tag team right here with the Cuba connection of El Sicario and Hijo del Tequila del, del Sol. Some famous wrestler just have a career match? Could that? Woo! Oh my goodness! Wait! Woo! Well, it looks like I did have the last match. It's like, this is like Rick Flair from the 70s, man. Skip 1991. The Fargo strut. Always making way for the champion, baby. Who's Rick Flair's partner going to be? Wait a second. Oh my goodness! It's Sting! Whoa! Surfer Sting! A blast from the past. Remember, Sting's last match was actually a little bit less than 30 days ago, beginning of March. Sting had his last match. So not only is this an Easter celebration of Easter, but this is going to be a celebration of woo, Sting! for the presentation of the belt. One of my most favorite parts of the this match. Those beautiful belts. The Stinger and Ric Flair. Woo! Those nice looking mustard yellow belts. The champions and the challengers. It could explode into an all Oh! Using one of Ric Flair's moves on himself. Team encounter should be a memorable one. And the air, old school wrestling move, folks. Gotta appreciate that. Oh, one of the most effective moves in all of WWE. He's pressing all the right buttons now. Big knee drop. And, the and there's the count. Working over the legs of Ric Flair. Okay, trying to use all the strength and power he can muster to escape this. Oh, wait, nice. And there's the reversal. Oh, he missed that one. God, that's got to hurt. Yeah, you're not doing any damage with swings like that, but keep doing it. The freeze may give him a cold. Looks like Ric Flair is starting to run out of gas. Guys, this is where we find out what he's made of. You know, this match is far from over, Michael, and it can really go either way at this point. Yeah, I don't think there's a clear-cut favorite right now. But regardless, we're underway and rolling. Oh, no, the Cuban Libre. WWE event. And now he 
Rice back out on the apron. Extra slow getting back to his base here. Getting oh, man, this right. has got to hurt. I'm not so sure if he even knows where he is. You have to wonder how much longer he can go on like this. And you know, it's just amazing to me that this is just another night in the WWE. Always memorable. Thank you for tuning in tonight. We're coming to you live from sunny Tampa. On the Submission hole locked in, and he's in big trouble. So good to be back in Tampa tonight. There are so many rabid WWE fans here in the Sunshine State. Uh-oh. Be careful now. The tag is made. Uh-oh. The stinger is in. Oh! Classic tag team movies. And he gets out of the way. <laughs> Man, this is a Cuba connection. To slow down a bit here. This tag team match can get out of hand quickly if he doesn't mount an offense soon. But hey, I have a feeling the WWE Universe is in for a Oh, Scorpion Death Drop! Oh my god. Can he end it quickly? And he breaks the cover, forcing the referee to stop the count. Well, that's just not enough to get the job done. Oh, wait, nice reversal. And he touches that one. Good lord, that wasn't even close. So that's what it's like being so far off the mark. We're looking at complete domination here. Here comes Sting. And he fails to connect with anything that time. Man, that was so incredible. The Cuban backbreaker. The championship hangs in the balance. And it could fall at any moment. This is a great matchup, Cole. Who's going to win this championship? Look out, look out. This could be it. And he gets out of the way. Oh, takes out Richard Flair. Oh, my goodness. Sting's off the level. He's out of partner. Coming live from sunny Tampa on the west coast of Florida. It doesn't get much better than that right there. Look at this. Somehow he's still going. Unless this thing turns around here, this tag team match is all but over. Back between the ropes. Let's see if we can keep it between the ropes. We've had enough of this on the floor action. I'm not comfortable when they're this close to me. strike. 
Talk about missing the target. Yeah, it looked like it was completely out of desperation. Oh, the Cuba Libre! He's out! Oh, his body has to be broken right now. God, there was nothing accurate about that attempted at offense. Oh, you're being too kind. Some people would use other words to describe what we did. What a move! Hey, Cole, this could do it! I think so! That was a good victory. Wow. Let's take that was a good showing by Big Sting. And woo, Ric Flair. That was fun. What Ric Flair says, in order to be the man, you got to beat the man. Or a super connection, just beat the man. This is Sting. Now that was an impressive victory. And you can bet there's going to be a celebration tonight. What a matchup that was. Truly awesome. incredible. That was a good match.
Oh, the super You knock it out of the park, and that was a perfect example of Magnum. Oh my goodness, I'm not gonna lie to you. Every time she has to get back to her feet. Oh my goodness. Here we go. The title may be coming down right now. Oh, look out. She missed her target that time. Yeah, I guess you could say she was just a bit. Watch out! What a wild attempt at striking your opponent. I don't know if she could have been further off the mark. <laughs> that was like a haymaker. Like she was taking that big home run swing. Oh, uh, look out. She missed her target that time. Yeah, I guess she could say she was just... Great reversal! She's hooked! Oh, there's a little spell up there. Oh my goodness, Mike Tessa Blanchard win this belt. Oh my god! Through the ladder! Keep ladder matches. Now those ladders have a mind of freaking out. Regardless, we and the rest of the WWE world are in for a night to remember. Oh my goodness, she might be dead. Right and knocked unconscious. Tessa might be able. Oh no! Tessa Blanchard! The down former right Impact oh, scary. Women's Knockout Champion. Like oh my goodness! And we have a new champion, folks. Whoa! There was no love lost in that match. And look at the impact in these highlights. I'm not good at ladder matches. Oh no, Tessa Blanchard. Is she gonna take this belt all the way back to Mexico? Oh, that's right, Cinco de Mayo. The Cinco de Mayo is coming out. Since so, so this is a celebration of Sting, as well as Eastern Mayo, with the eight tons of aluminum belt. From the line, I'm just gonna have a short card. I'm not gonna try to do an AEW pay per view. I don't have that nice mid range WWE pay per view length. So, yeah, we're gonna have one more. So, this is a good little event here. The eight pounds of aluminum. Made from genuine Daytona Beach littered beer cans and some brown leather belt found in the dumpster behind the gym. Nice. I made that belt look good. That's just classic looking brown on and polished aluminum. I mean, that was a little bit different entrance here. Let's see which version is challenging for the eight pounds of aluminum belt here. thing is this? Is this Joker's thing? Oh, this is WWE. Seth freaking Rollins just broke my next thing. It's nice to have a celebration of all these things. Thank <laughs> you. 
Eight pounds of aluminum. Sunny Bimbo. Put it. This one on one match is going to be a struggle in every sense of the word. Neither man looks like they are remotely entertaining the idea of backing down. This is gonna be good. Well, in these head-to-head -head matchups, you've got no one to rely on by yourself. And that's the way it should be. Well, there's no telling what we're gonna see here, but hey. Oh, feeling the he just threw a press him. Oh, the warrior press. Are we gonna see it? That's it. He's out. He's on the defensive here. I fully expect him to bounce. Hey, hoping to get up. And the shoulder's up in time. Well, as long as it's up before that three count, that's all that matters. He's starting to feel it here. But he certainly comes into this championship match with a ton of momentum. But hey, all I know is that we should sit back and enjoy. Another WWE show is underway. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hint of weakness in the other. Well, that's a strategy you have to always have in the back of your head, Cole. If you ever see a weakness in your opponent, you got to jump on it. And there's the reversal. And he touches that one. A concerned look on the face of Sting. He'll need to find a way to turn things around here. Nice. Sometimes I wonder if we're watching the same match. I mean, this one's still far from over, Cole. But regardless, this is just another in a oh, long line of awesome WWE sports entertainment. Honey, oh, missed that one. God, that's got to hurt. Yeah, you're not doing any damage nice. with swings like that, but keep doing it. The freeze may give him a cold. Well, that missed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. Quick thinking to avoid that. He's looking at it again. Oh, Scorpion it. Death that's Drop. Be it. Sting. Now that's Sting. a finishing move, people. Is that enough? For the and he breaks the cover, forcing the referee to stop the count. Well, that's just not enough to get the job done. What do you have to do to keep this guy down? Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy.
pounds of aluminum belt. Another win on the resume. Hey, they both gave it their all. But in the end, we were left with the best man standing. I couldn't agree more. What an amazing contest that was. There's a police APC in the background. Yep, you can't have a wrestling match in Daytona, in Daytona Beach without the Daytona Beach Police Department's own personal armored personnel carrier. That dirty crowd. NWO sting, by the way, folks. The black and white, semi-original. Also known as underneath the Dunlop and Bridge. Hobo Tom. Straight to the hobo show. He's done. It's going to take a lot to change the tide of this one. The end may be near. Well, thanks for coming. He's in perfect position. Complete control. Sting for a moment. Folks, the title is on the line of this one. And I can't remember a more highly anticipated title defense. And he fails to connect with anything that time. Man, that was some miss, all right. 
I could feel the breeze all the way over here. Michael, we're looking at a man who I know executed perfectly. And check out the look of satisfaction in those eyes. And he breaks the cover, forcing the referee to stop the count. Well, that's just not enough to get the job done. Here comes Sting. Yet another one for the oh. real. Not this. He's looking at it again. You gotta believe this one's over. Two straight headbutts. The groin. Oh, this is dangerous right here. Oh, I'm look at this head tag. Incredible. Measuring him. Straight headbutt. Stomps. Oh, he's kicking oh, when he's I down. remember Sting before he was called Sting. Started out training with Red Bastine in Southern California. He formed a tag team with someone WWE audience became very familiar with, the Ultimate Warrior. Sting was the franchise talent in WCW. And now that he's in WWE, who knows what's going to happen? We're looking at complete domination here. Look at this. Could it be? That's it. He's out. He's going to take another chance. And I can't believe. Watch it. Wow. He's still down after that. One of these guys is going to walk away with a win here tonight. I just can't imagine one of them also accepting defeat. Well, that messed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. Oh, he missed. Oh, nobody home that time. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. Sting is in position. You have to think that's it. Well, that messed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. Look at Stang making his moves. Nowhere to go. There's no escaping this. This might be it. Submission holds locked in, and he's in big trouble. Looking for the win. Oh, no. Oh my god! Sting. It just fell out of the cage. Oh, they couldn't find a home for that one. Well, it certainly wasn't due to a lack of trying, Michael. Oh! His head just bounced off the guardrail. Oh, Tom might be dead, folks. Oh, wait! Nice reversal! Oh my. This is exactly how he drew this one up. Hang on. It's all academic from here. There's two men. And he gets out of the way. Dodges to the side of that one. Two men enter. Both men leave, but both men are scarred for life after a hell in a cell. Oh, wait. Nice reversal. Oh, wait, nice reversal. Looks like he's 
starting to tire. I don't think this is how he envisioned this match going here tonight. Well, I don't think at this point that we can count any. That's how you move up the ladder here in WWE. The more punishment he takes, the slower and slower he is getting back to his feet. Enjoy Easter in a safe, sound, and responsible way. And a happy Easter here from all of us at the Daytona Beach Bump Fight League. Thank you. Enjoy the Easter fireworks. And boom goes the dynamite. Now it's, well, almost done. Bye.